I hope to gain a greater insight on the role of women, especially Indigenous women, and where not only where do we fit and where can we fit in Australian politics, but what new pathways can we try and open to empower us and be able to have our voices heard. Of course, it's my great pleasure to be the MC for this morning's proceedings um, here in Parliament. It's been great to be surrounded by um, amazing Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander women. Um, yeah, it's been really empowering and inspiring, I reckon. I think it's important for us to understand the lobbying process and have our voices heard. All the time back in the communities, we get our voices drowned out. And it was great just to hear different perspectives yesterday of what we think of the political system and really what other people think of it so we can, I suppose, utilise that information the best of our advantage to be able to talk about issues that are important to us. I think it's a really great um, networking opportunity to get women together from all across Australia um, in all different age ranges, different types of jobs, different roles in their community um, and to come together and to discuss things like gender, race, politics um, in a really open forum um, has been, I mean, super beneficial for me. It's been a really good learning experience for us to figure out how the political system works and what kind of change we can actually affect. Coming here, you really get that sense of like sisterhood and knowing that there's a lot of people out there being trailblazers in their community and there is a lot of people out there really advocating for our people. What I'd like to take back is the confidence to speak up for what I believe in, for our community to move forward and work together. Making those connections and continuing those connections by taking them back to community is going to empower not just ourselves but if we can empower one person then that one person empowers another person and that one person empowers the community and I think that's the vision of what Straight Talk is.